Alright. Hold on, guys. Alright. Welcome to Fear and Wine. We're back with uh, Ob uh, Observer Part 4. Uh, when we last left off, we found this chick in this crazy machine. We found out that the little girl we talked to, I guess, was actually older. It was true. And, um, talk to a drug dealer, or a guy who does drugs, and... I don't know. We're looking, right now we're looking for, uh, homeboy's wife. Amir. Sweet. I'll take that. I've only used it fucking one time. Okay, that's locked. Okay, so... Thanks for, uh, getting us in this room. Kyron lets you do more. Okay. Let's see if we can talk to this girl again. No? Okay, so... I believe the, uh, oh shit. I believe the other one was, uh, 203. Where the hell am I going? Yeah, over here. So I need to go up a little further. And see if we can talk to this next person. All right, birds, get out of here. This ain't no place for a, what does that say? <laughs> Full. All right, 210. There you go. All right, so we're looking for 203. Through here. The hell is this? Hey, a hookah. Sweet. That's pretty cool. This is like the little. Oh, pierogi. Just like some little kitchen area. A little place for everybody to hang out and talk about how shitty their lives are because they live in like one of the shittiest buildings known to man. You know, that kind of thing. Because as you know, misery loves company. Chiron is problem, not solution. Okay. <clears throat> Recharge your battery. Let the invigorating force flow. Through you, a unique blend of sugar and stimulants will keep your money, mind and body going. Okay. All right. Two oh eight, two oh nine. I guess we'll start asking a little bit of questions. KPD, I need to ask you some questions. Uh, what's your name, boy? Uh, I like to know who I'm speaking to. Daniel Lazarski. Uh, John Bukowski. Uh, good to meet you, Bukowski, Daniel Lazarski. Nice. Same here. Tell me, Daniel. That rumbling I heard, uh, was that all locked down? Yes, yeah, sir. It was. We're trying to rule out the phage. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't seem to bother you. <laughs> hey, are we, are we having fun or what? <laughs> I know you're from somewhere. The name rings a bell. <sighs> Lots of people used to know me. 
back when I was in the ring. Hang on. You're the champ. Bulldozer Bukowski. Oh. Uh, what's left of him? Uh, I used to be able to crush a man's skull with my bare hands. Uh, now I can't even wipe my own ass. Damn the brakes. What happened to your ass? <clears throat> Time happened. The corporation happened. My retirement happened. <coughs> Okay, bro. Don't choke on me yet, Temp. Tell me what happened. Oh, and after my contract ended, I had a hot date with the repo man. Damn. They stripped you down? <laughs> that would have been illegal. They they gave me an option. Could have kept my mods. It was only going to cost me two million a year. I get it. Back to bare basics. It must be tough to go on like this. I mean, it was two uh, nine. Yeah, but I can't just give up. Not in my DNA. I suppose the drugs helped you out a little? Hey. I ain't no fucking junkie. <laughs> you you got that? Oh, I guess it was two and nine. Yeah, well, I picked the right one. You get your painkillers from Amir. Uh, who? Come on, I found a big stash with your name on it. No need to who me. Uh, what the hell? <sighs> yeah, he he brings me stuff sometimes. Well, that's too bad because he's dead now. I gotta go. Oh, whoa. Hey, hey, hold on, Lasarski. Uh, what did you say? I said I gotta go. <sighs> no. No, before that. You said the kid's dead. <sighs> Damn. There goes my discount. Uh, any idea who did him in? I was hoping you could tell me. Uh, ain't got a clue. All right, champ. Hang in there. Uh, yeah, fuck you too. Okay. Yeah, that's both. Uh, both those people checked out. I. Right, she said he was walking towards the courtyard. Um. All right, let's see, uh, let's figure out where this courtyard is. We need a map. There we go. Oh, good. It's not a map. Oh, there it is. This kitchen. So let's go back down to the first floor. That's what we need to do. We checked out that whole bullshit, so... Let's get back down to it. Um, but maybe we should ask... A, hold on. Can we go down further? Alright, this is the G floor. Janitor... Oh, okay, yeah. Oh shit. Alright, I don't know if we should be going down here. No. It's uh now we can go ask that uh janitor guy. Let's see it right here. Fucking A. He's not here. Uh well let's take out check out the tattoo shop. I, mean, I guess we could do that, huh? There was a lot of, um, a lot of leads that were taking us to this area over here. So I guess that means the area is loading up. There's something. 
Yep. This game is getting a little fuzzy. Oh shit, okay. Synchrozine injected. Strain level decreased. Hello. Oh shit. My timing is really off today. Poor Helen. Okay, so maybe. 656210. We have a third victim. Time of death. About an hour ago, starting forensic analysis. That sucks. Broken nails, bloody fingertips, clear signs of the struggle. Yeah. Okay, what do we got here? Hold on. The victim's blood is mixed with ink. Elevated hormone levels. Don't tell me she was pregnant. Multiple puncture wounds. A few inches. She was deep. stabbed to death. Okay. We got a match. So you call the dead man in Adam's apartment. Oh. Okay. The size and shape of the needle are consistent with the puncture wound. So she was stabbed with the tattoo gun. It's pretty gnarly. The killer used the tattoo machine as a murder weapon. It's pretty... F Power adapter. Okay. The neural implants untouched. The trail goes cold. What the fuck did you think you'd find here? Let's find out. Attempting a necroneural connection is a direct violation of the Postmortem Observation Act of 2061. Authorization oh. denied. Emergency override. Open maintenance panel. Oh shit. This better be worth it. Oh god. Which means that if we they can't extract us if shit goes wrong in here. So we are on our own. Okay. Chiron Incorporated. Job interview, junior programmer. Welcome, Miss Novak. Do you want to make the world a better place? Sure. Do you want to live without fear? Sure. Do you want to establish a productive relationship with Chiron Inc.? Sure. Will you cooperate? Will you comply? Will you conform? The Republic is your mother. Chiron is your father. A mother's love is unconditional. A father's pride demands sacrifice. Are you willing to sacrifice for the greater good? Sure. Work. Productivity. Happiness. You will be happy. You will be productive. 
you will work towards the greater good. Will you obey? Sure. Finalizing subject assessment. Checking answers. Okay. Evaluating life choices. Subject spouse, criminal record. Checking. No liability regarding current appointment. Point deduction minor. Warning ignored. Calculating score. Thank you. Thank you. I know. I'm a bad motherfucker. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, nice job, Chair. Just straight balancing, huh? Oh! Jesus. That chair is. That chair exploded. That chair is bloat. Ah, the busy sounds of a fucking. God, can you imagine just? I'm sure there are some of you who work in cubicles, and I'm sorry. She's a robot. That guy's losing his mind. That guy's losing his mind. That guy's losing his mind. Or he comes in there and drinks coffee. What the fuck? Oh shit. Okay. Hey, a mirror, this man. Fucking slop again. It's called soup. But dig in. It's not getting any better. Yeah. Hey, you. Come here. Is that worm talking to me? Wait up. Shit. Damn it. Where'd you go? Okay. Worm, where are you? Shit. Dead end. Fuck. Oh, get out of here. There's no escape. I'm gonna be filing paperwork forever. There's literally no way out of here. There's something I'm missing. Look for one computer that looks different. Oh, whenever I stop. So let's see. Unfortunately, that doesn't really change anything. I'm still stuck here. Oh. God 
damn it. Okay. What is that? Okay. Not cool. Uh. Oh. Yeah. This for all those motherfuckers out in cubicles, huh? Yeah. Uh. Uh. I'm just kidding. I'm not gonna. Hey, worm, come back. Come back, worm. Uh. Yeah. I'm gonna follow you into your wormhole. Thank you. Jerking it really quick. You're gonna chafe it if you do it like that, bro. Hey, baby, I'm home. Okay. Oh God, somebody needs to do a fucking laundry over here. That fucking thing, whatever the fuck that is. I am not fan. Is that you? Fuck. Shit. I'm home. I can't do this anymore. I just can't. <laughs> Here is your number. Okay. Eight nine six.
Hey, kid. Is is mom gonna be all right? Oh shit! That's the Jesus. voice I heard earlier. Sick. Oh. Chest hard to say. So that's why he was hearing it. Does sitting there going like, "Where the fuck is that kid who's saying that? I can't find the room." This kid was in my head. I'm not sure about this. Not sure? D didn't you hear? This, this is great news. Let's take some more time to think about it. What is there to think about? You should be happy. Who says I'm not happy? <sighs> hey, who says I'm not happy? I'm ecstatic. Bitch. This is your chance. Chance to what? That's pretty cool, actually. That noise. Just take it easy. It is it is it done? Congratulations. You are now the proud owner of a CT72 internal data storage. I've given you an accelerant to make the tissue heal faster. Just keep that dressing on for the next couple of days. You uh are you sure they won't find it? It's got a built-in scrambler in a shielded frame. No external scanning equipment can penetrate it. It's ghostware. Undetectable. Unless you know exactly where to look. Okay. Just walking out of here. Bucket. Get your zero. What is this? The hell did you do to yourself? Don't Fuck. even start. I did what I had to. It's about time someone around here showed some initiative. What's that supposed to mean? Oh, you don't know. Hail no, Satan. Please, tell me. Tell me again how useless I am. How I can't keep a job because no one will hire a fucking junkie ex-con. Sure. Amir. Do you even know what you're getting into? It's not like I have a choice. We need the money, Amir. Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. Okay. Mark my words. That shit is gonna be the death of us. Shit, I forgot. Unlike Layers of Fear, there's something in this game that can kill us. Oh, fuck. I don't know what it is. 
Whatever, dude, I've been playing out last. Right. Doesn't mean it's not fucking terrifying, though. So I feel like all I've been doing lately, me and Angela has been playing hide and seek games, so. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> it's like, holy fucking play anymore. Why? Because it makes you shit yourself. Apparently, that's what we're into. Oh god. Another goddamn area? What is this? Oh, what the fuck? I don't even know what part of the fucking room I'm supposed to be going to. Like, am I going away from him? Am I going, like, over this way? Where's the fucking exit? Shouldn't it really, like, lit up or something? Oh, am I going to that computer? If so, that's not too bad. Right now. Uh, is he coming over here? Oh shit. Which way is it going? Okay, okay. Okay, he's right there. Cool. Fuck, 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 fuck. Good. Is there any more? Oh. Yay! Am I getting taken to cyberpunk heaven or something? Okay. Hey, cool. I guess. Um...
Damn, right down the sink, huh? So what are we doing? What? Oh shit! Okay, can I get out of here now? Fucking A. God, what the fuck? I don't understand what I'm supposed to do. Oh. Shit. TV baby. <laughs> I guess you're coming with me. Uh, you know, at least they're having a good time. That's all that fucking matters. Well, shit. Wait, why am I going this way if I could just opened it? leave you just come with me okay there we go see yeah we're having so much fun now What does this do right here? Oh. <laughs> what the fuck? I need to get in here. We'll just follow this thing. Oh, 
Okay. Hey, look, now we're back together again. Fuck. All right, what now? Oh, there you go. It's like we got all of it. So, what is all of this stuff exactly? It's probably best if you don't know exactly. It's not anything nasty, is it? Like a virus. This is Adam's room. Some top secret weapon type shit. <laughs> no, nothing like that. What then? I mean, what could possibly be worth the risk? The future. What the fuck? Okay, so yeah, don't let him detect you whatsoever. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. We're heading towards that beam of light. I don't think I can do this anymore. I think they're on to me. You're being paranoid. No one's on to you. You don't get it. Every time I go in there, it's like they're all watching. Yesterday, this executive creep gave me this look, like, I, I could just tell he knew. If they knew, we'd all be dead by now. Maybe they're just messing with our heads. And what purpose would that serve? I don't know, to get their fucking sadistic load off? That's not how they operate. Trust me, I was with the corporation long enough. Alright guys, well that's going to be the end of it. We pushed it about 15 minutes longer. I thought the hallucination was going to end. But, um, this is fucking crazy. I have no idea what the fuck's going on. I'm just kind of going with it at this point. But, um, we'll be back with uh, part 5 at some point. <clears throat> but, um, yeah, I think this is, it's fucking trippy. I've like, at a loss for words half the time I'm playing these parts. I'm just like, what the fuck? Alright guys, um, as always, until next time, peace.